And welcome back to No Man's Sky, everybody. And this is episode two of season three of the Fugitive Challenge from Beeblebum. And we're just heading on our merry little way. As you can see, we're picking right off where we were on the last episode. Um, there should be a piece of technology right here. Yeah, that's right there. I know it. Not going to let me grab it, are you? I'm going to have to go the old-fashioned way. There we go, and I really don't like that first-person view. It really annoys me. All right. We're heading south. Oh, hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello there. Back off. I don't feel like this guy biting my shoelaces off my feet again. Because he usually takes my feet with him. And two. Hi. Hi, Mr. Sentinel. Nothing to say here. I'm just moving along. What are you? Ooh. Well, there's only one, but I'll go ahead and take it. You never know. It might be handy. Oh, wait a minute. There's three of them up there. Oh. Oh, okay. That was close. Where is he? Like I said, I can always use more oxygen, so I'll go ahead and grab it. Looks like life support's getting a little low here. Like I said. Alright, that's all I'm getting out of it. And we need more life support. And what do we do to do that? We need this and we need carbon. Okay, you can investigate. I'm already done. Okay, south we go. Tally ho. Let me see. Okay, we'll get four more life support shells out of it. And we're running low on carbon, so we got to keep our eyes open. Okay. And I'm not seeing anything in this direction, but... Well, say la vie, you know. Okay, there we go. Thank heavens uh, no storms up here at this particular level. I don't think we can take that one, yeah. No littler ones, so, okay. Moving on, moving on. So again, you know, uh, if you're unfamiliar with the fugitive run, permadeath, extreme, Maximum settings on the permadeath, uh, including if you die, you lose everything, including the game. So you have to start all over again. No starter ship. You're not even allowed to touch your starter ship. I went near it because I was blind and I didn't know it was anywhere near me. So, but I went near it. I didn't take anything from anywhere near the campsite or any of the, the items that were there. So I'm safe. Um, let's see. Okay, moving on. Uh, let's see. Not only can we not go near our starship, our starter ship, that is, but the only thing we can do is find a crashed ship. See, there's a building there, and it's not showing up on my radar. That's really, really strange. So we can't even use it in any way. We have to find a crashed ship instead. We can't trade for one, even if we get enough money. We have to be able to... We have to be able to, um find a crash ship and we can trade our starter ship for the crash ship so we never actually ever use that ship and get any monetary value out of it so that's that's key right there all right oh a little too high there gotta be careful now, I don't know what the structure is it is there but boy my scanner stinks on this little uh, multi-tool I'm not actually going to go to the structure. I'm just curious as to what it is. All right, there we go. A little bit of, and I'm pretty sure it is not abandoned. Well, this is a loud planet, isn't it? Wish we could put a mute on the volcanoes. 
Um, oh, it's one of those structures. Okay, yeah, we definitely want to stay away from those. Uh, south. So what, why is that building selected? Haven't I already been there? Hmm. Because I've been heading from this general direction from the... So I'm heading south. I don't know. I'm missing something up here. I might be heading in that direction. All right, let's head over here. I think I took a look at the building and realized I couldn't go there. Maybe that's what it was. And until I select something else, it'll remain selected. But we'll see. Hey, how about a heat shield? Heat shield, heat shield, heat shield. Nanites. That was my second choice. Can we get it? Can't get it. All right. There we go. All right, so we're kind of heading sideways, cattywampus, a little bit, if you will. Okay, let's see here. I still think that's a building I've been to, so why in the world did I get that messed up or mixed up? But I, I find it necessary to head that direction just in case, or at least look at it from a distance. Because I think it was just... Yeah, it's a shelter with what looks like a minor settlement. Second minor settlement I found. Second trading I found. It, uh, fourth trading, if you will. I don't even know. I'm losing track, but I think, like I said, it's mocking me. Okay. Moving on. Is that... That's another building, too. That same distance, so it's just pointing to the shelter and to the building there. Oop, I forgot. So I'm going to have to do this the hard way. There we go. Because otherwise it tries to use up two batteries on me, and I don't want to do that. I'm finicky. Alright. Doesn't appear to be anything in my path, so we're going to keep going. We're on the quest to find our crashed ship. We're not allowed to interact with any terminals or go into any other buildings. We can go into abandoned buildings. We'll clear them of the uh, whispering eggs, but that's about it. And we've done that one time. One land near me or something? Very rare do you see two go across unless one of them disappeared from the formation, but it can happen. Alright, anything out there? Am I going? Yep, okay, let's keep going. Now that guy just took off going the other way. Okay, good for him. I'm doing a lot of looking because I'm really desperate on finding a ship here. Beeble Bum found one in an hour and 15 minutes into his last run. I couldn't believe it. I'm like, you've got to be kidding me. What is with these guys? And they just get so fortunate with these things. So... Here we go. Alright, got some buried technology over there. I guess I'll head that way. Oh, well, there's one some right in front of me, too. 332... Yeah, let's just go to that one. Maybe we'll find some damaged machinery on the way. Not a lot of damaged machinery here, I'll tell you that. Starship launch fuel. Okay, well that's wonderful. How about you? Can we grab you? 
And... No, not this time, huh? Okay. South. What is south? Nothing is south. But south we go. And, yeah, see? I told you, they always bite my shoelaces. I think he has my right foot in his mouth. That's okay. He grows back. Nothing. Nada. Nil. Squat. Zilch. Alright. A little further. A little further. A little further. Gotta find myself another cave, too. I need to look for that. But oh, you've gotta be joking with me. I'm just gonna... There. Take that. Oh, my gosh. Alright. Stop. Let's take it slower and take a look and make sure that we're not missing something here. Come on, shield. Recharge. I mean, I can't stand still. I gotta keep moving, but you need to recharge. There's one right in front of me. All right. All right, let's see. Nothing here. Nothing here. Got one more creature to find on this planet. It's underground and it's rare, it says. Ah, building. Check around, make sure we're not missing another one. Okay. I think my thermal protection is falling. Hey, cadet's cart. And no sentinels around to see me take it. Mwahaha. Alright. So looking pretty good here. What I'm going to do is at the end of this video, I am going to take a pause. And I've got a couple videos already recorded tonight, but I haven't uploaded any. I've been literally making the videos and not uploading anything. So we need to get the anomaly video uploaded, so I'll be taking care of that. And it's a building. And it's one of those buildings, too. So we got to stay away from that building. But you are basically um, due south of me. So anyway, is there any buildings nearby besides this one? No. Lots of stuff, but that's it. Alright. So we're going to go over this way. I'll head towards you. Oh, hello. I'm going to use my sodium this time. Alright. Sorry little focus there. Sorry it got quiet. So we're really just kind of gathering as much as we can. 10k. Yeah, I agree. Thanks. I love being rubbed into my face. But we're going to show you another landing platform just to make you jealous. Aha. Uh -huh. We find it getting dark in my room right now. How weird. Uh, out of there. Okay, good. Uh, let's see. Nothing. South we go. Good. You could always use those crystals. Get more dihydrogen for our buck. Did I just get more? Yeah, I did. Good. Excellent. That was even better. Okay. Very nice. I think I can get two. Very nice. Put your launch fuel over here. Okay, keep going. Take another peek. 
Okay, keep going. Now, I had my very first run, I ended up running into two gravestones in my antics on the ground. No, I don't... Obviously, I want to recharge my... Yeah, the beam, mining beam, very important to get done right this second. Okay, let's see. Plants. Nothing else. Grab some more sodium. We had to use some before. Uh, I'm kind of glad I got that upgrade for the jetpack. Swore, okay, that was a plant. Okay. Hello. Watch the... Mm. <sighs> These plants are literally going to be the death of me. Peak. Still nothing. I've got a plant right next to me. Three nice ships flying overhead. Ah, we got a building. Likely just a building building, but it looks like a building. Yeah, we'll head in that direction. Hopefully there might be a cave nearby. Maybe there's a cave nearby we can duck into. Ah, a little bit of sodium while we're here. I don't know what that is. Hold on. I think it's just a campsite. So we won't do anything out except pass through. Yeah, that's all it is. Take some of the supplies. All right. Ah, another battery. Thank you very much. Nothing found. That's okay. South, south, south. That's north. There's south. Okay. Take a look around because sometimes they come in clusters. Portal. Yeah, we're not heading towards the portal, but it's good to know that it's there. All right, we'll go to the buried technology and head that direction. Onward. No cave here. There we go. Okay. Literally nothing around. Of course, Jason's probably found about three crashed ships by now, and he has his choice between all three of them. I can eat some more life support gels. I know I got four of them on me right now, or maybe three, but I need to press forward on those. Investigate all you want. I'm done there, my friend. Okay, looks like we got some buried tech down here. And a cargo drop. Yeah, I see it. 
Again, I can always use more oxygen. It looks like I have some condensed carbon over there, too. I'll go ahead and grab that here in just a second. Good. Oh, one more. Okay, there we go. Hmm. Either nothing's up. Oh, there it goes. Boy, it's taking a long time to populate lately. I don't know what's going on. There we go. Alright, let's take a look. <sighs> yeah, a whole lot of nothing. It's a shame. Okay, moving on. A cave? Looks like it could be. Yeah, it is. I will stand right here. And I will take a look. Maybe the... The uh, animal that was eluding me will show up. All right, that's south. We do have some damaged machinery over there. Let's highlight that. Okay, nope, not seeing anybody. I do have some buried cash there. That might be worth some time. And the buried mineral formation. Grab it. Hey. Herox. That's good. Hey, that's good. Wait a minute. Excellent. All right. Good, good, good. And while we're here, I think Herox, if I'm not mistaken, I think it does give you gold. What does it give you again? That also gives me silver. Well, that's useless to me. Okay. Uh, let's see. So we're going to put you down here. How much of that silicon do we have? Let's go ahead and add that to our tool and get rid of it so we have some extra room in our inventory. We're doing good on oxygen, finally. We're probably going to get rid of that. I don't really need it. Uh, great places. Okay. Looking good. Okay, we are... Lights out. Let's get out of the cave and move on. Okay, 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 we're gone. Okay, damage machinery. Heat shield is what we are after here, my friend. We will take nanites, of course, but heat shield is what we really would rather have. Thank you very much. If you know, asking is wishing and everything like that. Nope. No chance of that this time. No. Not this time again. Seems like these guys are harder to get. I don't know why. Okay. South. Anything to our south. Sounds like we're about to have a volcano erupt. No? Okay, so we're gonna go that way. Okay. I don't like to run with my headlamp on, but... But it's a little darker. I think we're in a shadow or something. Corvax casing. Don't need it anymore. Okay. 
There we go. Nice. A little bit of a good boost there. Ah, we've got plenty of buildings coming up ahead. Uh, let's go to this one first. Good, about time. So we are about an hour and a half into the run itself. Okay. What do we got? A crashed ship. Please tell me it's pilotless. It is, ladies and gentlemen, we are into it. An hour and a half. It took us only an hour and a half. All right, I want to duck into the cave so I'm fully charged before I run out there. Okay? And maybe we can get our little uh, rare entity to show up in here. Awesome. Fantastic. Fastest I've ever found a crashed ship. By far. I, I had a funny feeling with two buildings so close to each other that maybe uh, one of them would be a crash ship. And it looks like it's an explorer class, so that's good. That's extra... Um, why is this taking so long? It's uh, good for hyperdrive, so that'll be really nice. May not be the prettiest one in the world, but hey, I'll take it. Come on, get all the way up there. You can do it. There we go, okay. Alright, first things first, I want to claim it before it just vanishes on me. Uh, C-Class, I really don't care, it does actually have a supercharged slot on it, so at least that's something. And I'm gonna swap it, remember as I said, we're gonna swap it. Yes, uh, no, no, uh... No. Proceed with exchange. Oh, it's telling me to do that. Proceed with exchange anyway. Yes. All right. So we get nothing out of it. See that we didn't get anything else. So now we have to repair it. But before we do, did we just see? Okay, it was a flag waving. I thought a ship just landed next to me. I was like, what is going on? All right. What are we going to get here? Just some nanites. Okay. That's all right. That's all right. I don't need the heat shield anymore. It would have been nice to have it, but still. Okay, Viking Effigy, and that projectile. Alright, what can we get from this? Uh, here's Light Smash, Waves, Dim and Dim, Pilot Column reports the news of imminent demise, some explosions, tearing metal. Functioning technology is what we want. This is going to give me the transporter, probably. Yep, teleport, teleport receiver, so we can work with our ship a little better. We had to get that one first, so no big deal. Alright, so what do we need? We need pure ferrite, so let's drop our refiner down over here. We should have plenty enough. We should have enough ferrite. Yes, we do. We need 50 of it. It's not going to let us change that until we get this done. There we go. Let's get that moving. We need a metal plate. Let's see, let's go ahead and do that in a hermetic seal, which we get, of course. I think we just need, yep, condensed carbon. We've got that, so that's repaired. Uh, we need a dihydrogen jelly. Uh, we don't have anything we can make that with, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, we got to get some dihydrogen. Let's go ahead and at least get that half repaired. What do we do to get the shields repaired? Dichromatic metal and sodium nitrate. Okay. We may be leaving you down on the ground for a minute. Okay. Uh, scan. Dihydrogen, dihydrogen. Over there. Here we go. Okay. That's all the dihydrogen over here? Are you serious? Well, I got some sodium over there. That's helpful. Not really. Where's my dihydrogen, folks? Oh, there's some right in front of me. Nope, that's not it. But that is. Sometimes the canisters near the ships will have a dihydrogen in there, so that's why it's usually a good idea to check them before you start repairing things. And why don't we get that, too? There we go. Alright. Do we have enough? I don't know if we have enough. Do we have enough? 
Yeah, we do. Okay. Where'd the ship go? Where'd be our ship? Good grief. There's literally so much noise over here, I don't know what's going on. Wow. Okay, back to the starship. Let's get you repaired. Alright, so the main repairs are done. I do need chromatic metal and sodium nitrate. Let's get the sodium nitrate 13. Uh, yeah, I'll put you in there. Sodium. We need 13, so we need 26. Okay. And I need more chromatic metal. So we need some copper. Because I want to get that shield done up. Is that... Oh, okay, that's magnetized. Uh, how about you? Copper, 428. That's pretty good. How about you? Okay. Pyrite. Oh, yeah, we needed pyrite, too. Again, we're going to be very careful here. 320. There's some right there. Yeah, 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 I know. All right, good. I'm going to actually pull it out. There we go. Because I want to get, I want the shield to be repaired. I don't have a choice in the matter. And then we'll ch ch fix the chromatic metal. I definitely need this repaired too, so we need a lot of chromatic metal. So we need both of those repaired. I got microprocessors, so we can get that repaired. That's good. That'll be my hyperdrive. Excellent. All right, we're in good shape here if we can get these things done. Yeah, 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 I know. All right. Let's do this. Again, we want to be careful, because I've run into this before. Uh, while we're here, hold on, that's what I was going to do. I was going to start getting the copper going. That I currently have. Copper, 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 there you go. There, let's get that started. Okay, on we go. Man, it's loud. Anybody hear anything? Good grief. Take the aerial. Okay. Oh, wow. Is this a double? It is. Wow. We'll probably just get some nanites out of it. No, oh, launch fuel. That's handy. We'll get the other one. Oh, I almost had it. You got the other one, too. What do you know? Oh, uh, yeah, crap. I'm going to go ahead and use both. Is there another piece of buried technology here, though? Because sometimes there is. There is. There's a second one over here. Next to that. Good. Now, how much inventory space we have open? We got enough. Enough. Yes, we do. Let's go ahead and get it. Want to get as much copper as we can, because it looks like we're going to need a lot to get this ship repaired. What in the world? There. I feel like being damaged. And there's another technology there. Holy mackerel. All right. Feeling pretty good. Nice. What I should do is I should name, like, my episode Reach the Galaxy Center or something like that. I've reached it. Challenge complete and have everybody look at it and go, Ha, sucker. But no, that would be mean. I'm not going to do that. Nobody will ever watch again. You're right. Don't do that. Always be truthful in everything you do, especially to yourself. That's where it starts. You know how I say that all the time. So, yeah, we'll keep to that. I think it's a good practice. Kaboom. Okay, yeah. Darn volcanoes, man. So this is where I'm going to actually get some silicon because I need to recharge this uh, unit on occasion. I may have to actually get more copper. I mean, the ship will take off and land, but it's it really need the shield, and I really need my hyperdrive. Thank you very much. Okay. 
and it's more damage machinery. How interesting. Really, I never did get the underground uh, critter, critter uh, to complete it, but it is what it is, I guess. All right. Now, how much copper did we end up with? Uh, 400. Okay. Let's see if that'll be enough. Got a couple deposits of condensed carbon over here I want to grab, so we're going to do that. Alright, good, 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 good. Take that, take that, take that. Actually, since we're here, let's go ahead and grab it. We really could use it. And we are going to get some pyrite, too. We really do need that for launch fuel. Or is that for the... Say the way around. I think the uranium's for the launch fuel and... Yeah, uranium's for launch fuel. Pyrite is for flying far. Okay. Oh, there you are. Hi there. All right, let's put the rest of the copper in. Let's start you up. Just, yeah, we'll put you in. All right. All right, we'll let that go. Actually, let's go ahead and pull it out. Um, how much do we need? I think we needed 50, if I'm not mistaken. That should be enough for now. Keep it going. Okay. Uh, starship. So, I'm going to start with repairing my shields, because that's a little bit more important. I do need to get the guns done. We need pure ferrite and 30. Okay, we can do that. Do we have enough ferrite on us to begin with? Yeah, we do, actually. Not bad. So, look at well up here. All right. While I'm at it, not there, there. Uh, let's see, the shield is repaired, but I don't really have any room. Let me see here. There. Because we can put this here. And that'll give us a little bit of a boost to our shield strength. That's nice. When we get that one repaired, it'd be kind of nice. But we'll see. We'll see what happens. Oh, okay. We're really we're chugging along there. Keep that going. All right. So, who's next? Hyperdrive. Repaired. Okay. I need a wiring loom, so I can't really do much there. I need pugnium... Gold. I guess I could have used the gold, huh? Okay, we don't have a lot of cargo space until we can start repairing things on this ship. But that's okay. Now we're getting somewhere. Oh, chlorine, huh? That's weird. I gotta find some salt somewhere. Magnetized ferrite, I need 100. Hmm. Let's take a look. How much have I need? 100 magnetized ferrite. 150. 200. 250. 300. Okay, 300 magnetized ferrite. We can use some pyrite too, right? Okay, there we go. Alright. So pure ferrite 50, sodium nitrate 30. Ferrite. 
go. So this ship's going to be in pretty good shape once we get this done. I'm so, so excited about this. Elena, I like that. We need sodium nitrate. How much do we need again? Let's find out. 30, so I need 60 of that. 60. Oh, good. Okay, that'll be done in a moment. Check the cave. Let's take a quick look while we're looking in that direction. Make sure that a creature didn't pop up that we can scan. Because that one little creature, that's going to get us about, uh, I don't know, about 1,000 or 1,200 uh, nanites. If we can get it. Got it. Okay. And that should get our guns repaired. Alright, so we're in better shape now than we were. Okay, I am very happy with that. I would like to get that 300 magnetized ferrite, and I do need some pyrite. Uh, let's see. So is there anything we in our inventory we can throw into our ship real quick, first of all? Let's go with the Starship launch fuel and uranium. Definitely. Let's put the that in there. We're going to keep these, obviously. Let's keep this on us for now. Keep the chromatic metal on me. You're staying here. Put this on the ship. There. Okay. Well, let's go get some stuff. Um, again, we want to be careful. Magnetized ferrite is literally 61 units right there. So it's right in front of me. I need 300. So we need 300 of this. We are at a hundred. How are we doing time wise? We're doing good. Doing good. 150. Hello. I hate when it does that. Everything got caught fire while I'm standing there. About 200 that we're at right now, I guess. Just need a full stack of this stuff. Alright, did we get a full stack yet? Just that second we did. Unbelievable. Good deal. Alright, what are we repairing? So we're going to spread it around is what we're going to do. Like, we're going to put some there. If we can find some salt, we can unleash that one. That one we can do. There's another one. We can do this one. We'll need a lot more chromatic metal to get the rest of this going. Okay. All right. Oh, and you are sodium. I'm going to try upgrading that at one point, but we'll see what happens. I don't have a lot of more, a lot more sodium left. But yeah, that gets us moving along. Is that used up all of our magnetized ferrite? I have one left. Goodbye. Good. All right, excellent. So now we need pyrite. All right, so let's look for pyrite. And this pyrite right there, 489. Is there any closer? 220. Okay, that's a little closer. It looks like it might be in the volcano, though. I don't think we can't go in there. Okay, never mind. Uh, copper. We already did that one. That one's further away. I write 408. Let's go to this one. We just got to be careful. But the pyrite will definitely help us. You know what? I haven't scanned too many plants. Sometimes the plants have... 
I mean, inorganics may have stuff in them, but sometimes you run across something that has... I'm in a hole. Okay, let me get across the hole here. You know, these rocks sometimes have salt in them, on occasion. So it's worth checking, even though that's a primary item. We'll just get rid of it so that it, all the rest of them turn green when I look at them. Carbon. Because if we can get salt from something... Oh, that's not actually a... Interesting. Dihydrogen. Yeah, I doubt there's going to be salt on this planet. The most I think we'll find is we might find some basalt, but I doubt that even then. There we go. Okay. Yeah, I'll scan it anyway. That way it's out of the way. All right. I think that about covers them all. I don't think we're going to find any. So, And it looks like that is inside the volcano as well. That was a waste of time. Okay, well, say la vie. Pyrite 312. We'll go ahead and take that pyrite. Oh, there's a nasty little plant that wants to bite my ankles. Another one over there. Now here's the thing, is we can call our ship in now, so we're going to call our ship over here. Do we have our... Yeah, we do. We have our refiner. Good. Ah, I am really getting sick of that. See? We can call it in now. Alright. I could use a nice full stack of this, my friend. If you don't mind, 300 for this would be wonderful. If you would be so bold to give me that. Alright, so where are we at here? Not quite an hour into this, so... We're going to be gathering up some silicon as we go because we are a little low on the charge on this unit. There we go, that's better. Oh, slow down, slow down, slow down. Okay. There we go. Alright, how much pyrite do we have? 174, and we're losing our charge. So we need about 120 more. We got 50 more. I don't know how many we got. Hold on. Okay. Well, it doesn't look like we're going to get the 300 we want, but that'll be okay, I guess. All right. How many do we got? No, we did get 300. Yay! Okay, good. Good, good, good. Silicon. Drop it in. Okay. That looks just dandy. All right, and where's our ship? There's our ship. All right, so what do we have here? So we definitely need to get some chlorine. Paraffinium and the pugnium are going to come when they will. Gold is another story. We can get some out in space. We have chromatic metal, but we definitely need more copper to make more chromatic metal. How much do we need all total? Let's take a look. We can't get that. Uh, can't get them e yet either. All right, well, we'll need a lot more. So, 75. Let's just say 75.
Okay, I see. Let's add them all together, my bad. Uh, let's see, so 60, 120, 180, 240. Uh, I see, that's uh, 240, 290, 390. 390. So we need about 400, so we'll need about 800 chromatic metal, plus we got to make antimatter. So, I'd say about at least 500, 600, as much as we can get, basically. So, let's take a blast out into space. Launch thrusters could use a charge, so let's use up... I want to get rid of the launch fuel, so I'm going to use it up. Uh, let's switch over to that. There we go. It's not a bad-looking ship, at least, at least it's symmetrical. Um, I don't want to get a whole lot of resources with my ship just yet, so we're going to go ahead and take off and see if we can find a more hospitable planet. And we have escaped to the stars. It looks like I discovered this system, so this is a brand new system. That looks like a moon. Um, we'll have to take a little pulse out there to get closer. It is a planet. Looks like a tiny one, though. It's abandoned. That's good. Copper and sodium. All right. What other planets do we have out here? Should be one right there. Oh, there it is. Right there. Well, let's head in that direction. We gotta get out of the way, away from the planet to discover things, so we'll head out. All right. What planet do we have here? Magma. Hmm. Sounds familiar. That's three, two planets that are bad. Um, seems to be planets out this way. What in the world is that? Silver. Okay. We need gold, so let's keep going. Tritium is alright. We could always use that, but you know, not a whole lot of it. There's some gold there. Okay. while we're here. I don't need the silver as much as I need the gold. shooting his stuff. But I know we don't have 50 gold yet. Gold cluster would be kind of nice. What in the world were those things? Did you see that? I'm, I'm sure I saw that. Yeah, there's something there. I'm not sure what those give me, but I think they're protecting the field. remember that. That's very weird. Never seen that before. Alright, getting plenty of tritium, but I could really use some gold here, buddy. Gold nugget. About time. Let's see. Still not enough. Need four more gold. Got a storm approaching in space. Not that that really does anything to us, but we should get some platinum out of that. Gold. Okay, we got gold. So what was it that needed gold? Not you. All right, let's get out of here. So our planets that we need to look at are on the other side of this planet. That should be good. But let's check our ship and see what we need to fix. There was something that needed gold. You do. Okay. And I think... Oh, we know. We need more gold. Son of a gun. Alright, well, I'll worry about it in a little bit. Let's see where our planets are. 
Okay, we got one here. Of course there's a hostile scan. I don't really have much of a choice. Well, wait a minute. Oh, okay, that wasn't what I was trying to do. Okay. Uh, I don't know how many ships there are, but I think there's only the one. And I can always use something from you, my friend. I can use your death. Thank you. I got a suspicious packet. Let's get rid of that. I got an anomaly detector out of that thing. I don't know what I got. No clue. It'll tell me in a minute. A geode. And then, ferrite dust. Alright, where are the planets at? Swamp planet. Copper, magnesium. Ancient bones. Ooh, way to make money. Ammonia and sodium. Stop. And what else we got? Looks like we got a moon on the other side of that. That could be really handy. Let's go check out the moon, shall we? You know what moons are good for? They're small, and they're good for checking it out to see if there's anything on them, like, I don't know, crash ships and stuff. Let's just check around real quick. I don't want to make sure I didn't miss any planets on the way. Whoop. Hello. Back the other way. Magma, okay. I think we got it all. Alright, so let's get over to this planet, and I think we're going to call this episode very, very soon. So what do we end up with on board? Okay, we got a little bit of gold, we got quite a bit of silver, which is surprising. Pretty decent ship, we got decent shields, but man, it wasn't holding up even against the one guy, so I'm a little bit upset about that. We do need to install the teleport receiver. Yes, I get it. But we're going to need stuff. Let's see what we got. It is a moon. Excellent. Overgrown. Should be relatively okay. We got paraffinium on board there. And we got salt. I can get, I can get uh, chlorine from that when I refine it. And we get copper here. And is there any water on this planet? It doesn't appear to be. Moon. I keep saying planet. Moon. I don't see any. I think this is mostly land-based. Okay, let's bring it in and take a look. Now we want to take it really... Whoop, back the other way, back the other way. Slow. Look for stuff. I learned that from Beeblebum. Take your time. Now, it looks like copper right there, so I'm going to go ahead and stop by and I'm going to fill up because I need chromatic metal. Okay, excellent. So I think we're in really good shape here. Smallest planet, it says. Well, it's a moon, to be honest, so... And the, uh... Sentinels are not hostile, so that's good. So we should be in good shape. The only thing I'm going to watch for is there may be storms on this planet. Seems to be temperate. That's a decent temperature up there, 90 degrees Fahrenheit. A little warm for my taste, but that's okay. Warm is not scalding, and I'm not dying. I don't have to use anything, so that's excellent, excellent. So I don't need any kind of heat shields or anything like that. Again, unless a, you know, storm brews in. But I can deal with the occasional storm, so be it. Wow, this is a really big deposit. We're already at 200. I would like to get about 800. I would really love to have a thousand out of this, but this deposit is big enough that I think it will provide that. And I'm going to have to probably get some more silicon to get my, uh... Oh, yeah, of course the cloud's got to come up and not see what I'm doing. All right, how far? We're a little over an hour on this episode right now, so this is good. Made excellent progress. I mean, we found a ship. 
30 minutes into this episode, an hour and a half into the whole run, so that is excellent. We are in good shape, we are gathering the supplies we need, repairing the ship left and right. We should have everything we need on this planet. I would like to find all the flora on this planet, uh, pardon me, fauna on this planet, in order to get the nanites I need to keep getting upgrades, so we'll continue that idea. Yeah, look at that. Already at, uh, what, 500? Yeah. There we go, 500 copper. Alright. Let's go ahead and recharge this real quick. Alright, used up all I had left, so I'll have to get some more silicon. And... Boy, this is fantastic. I don't think I've seen such a big copper deposit before. Even on some of my other runs that I had on uh, some of the expeditions I've done, I've never seen anything this large. Yeah, joke amongst yourselves on that one. Wow, good grief. I haven't even reached the bottom of this one yet. Alright, I'm gonna have to get some silicon here, so let me wander over here a little bit. And at the 20 mark, I'm gonna go change directions. Okay. I think what this is, I think this copper deposit might be a double deposit or something like that. It might just be an aberration, a glitch in the game, if you will. Okay. Almost empty. And there. Let's get a little bit more, because that took up 240 of it. And I'm gonna need the rest to keep going, so I'll need at least 500 of this stuff. All right, there we go. Okay. So this is a fabulous deposit. Absolutely amazing. So we're going to be sitting here mining for a while. It goes on forever. I'm just going to go to the bottom of this thing to see. Oh, there we go. Finally reached the bottom of the deposit. Good grief. Alright, how many we got? Three, six, nine. And I'm filling up another one. So we're over a thousand right now. Where's my ship? There's my ship. Do we even have enough carbon? Let's get that moving. So this will keep us into the chromatic metal for a long time now. We do want to probably keep a stack of copper on us, just in case. Now, sodium will be very handy for recharging our ship shields, so we should really go after sodium deposits, too, if they have any here. I don't think I'm going to be able to take this whole deposit. Unbelievable. Wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful.
Let's just keep going. And we are going to need some more carbon soon. Wow. Have you ever seen a deposit this big? I mean, I don't... I mean, this has got to be like a 2,000 unit deposit. Because I'm about to fill my inventory. Three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen. Yeah, they're easily. This is easily a two thousand unit deposit. That's an interesting little creature, huh? I'll go ahead and grab him while I can. Seven creatures here, too. Probably gonna have some underground. Three. Four. I don't think that unit is running right now, is it? Yeah, he's right. Why am I getting pyrite? Oh my god, did I just put all my pyrite in there? Yeah, it is. That's what's been going on. Well, that's alright. We'll be okay. I pulled that out. Yeah, that's not a surprise. That was stupid. How much pyrite do I have left? Well, it'll have to do. Okay. You know what, though? We can get more. Speaking of which, what is this planet good for? What do we got? Paraffinium and salt. Oh, so there's a salt deposit someplace. So isn't that interesting? Okay. Salt deposit. So I don't even have to look at the plants if I don't want to. I can just find a deposit someplace and pull some out of it. I don't need much. I'll need probably about 20 salt, so I'm just going to be touching it, I guess. I don't know what you want to call it. Kicking it with my boot. All right. Okay. Copper. We are going to have to put a recharge in there, which means I'm going to need some carbon soon. And this manipulator is about done again. Okay, I think we're done. How much do we have? Too much, probably. Alright, where is there some carbon? How about right there? Primary element. I don't need any more ferrite dust now. Okay, we got this, those plants. That's good to know. Let's get some carbon. Carbon, carbon, carbon. Because we will definitely need a lot of it. Alright, that should be good. Oh, you're done again. Because we need carbon. 
Okay. All right, let's go back to the starship and see what we can get repaired here. So we're going to go ahead and put that in there. We need wiring looms, so we're not going to be able to get them anytime soon. This one will be fully repaired. Uh, we're almost there for that one. We need more gold. Okay. Copper. Make sure we're not grabbing the pyrite. Okay, looks like this one will be done. Any that we can just get repaired completely just now? No? Okay. Quite a bit of ferrite dust. All right. So, why don't I just continue this lovely thing right now? And I'm going to shut down this episode. We're going to call it here. How come it's red? I don't know. It's just glowing right now. So, we got ourselves a ship. Yay! And we're going to go ahead and pick up in the next episode. We'll pick up where we left off here. I'm going to continue mining in between episodes. So, you don't have to sit there and watch me grind that out. So, enjoy. I hope you enjoyed this. Please hit the like button. Please hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. Thank you very much, folks. See you in the next episode. Take care.